What's up guys? Uh, today, mag-unbox tayo na basic tattoo kit. So, nabili ko ito for $1.5 or uh, $25. So, unbox natin pa naman laman. So, I just try to purchase this to see if uh, ano ang nasa loob ng package na 1.5 so try natin ganyan ang laman so guys this is just for a beginner's kit so beginner's tattoo kit kung kayo ay gusto mag practice mag tattoo I think uh, pwede nyo mag try so, pero Tingnan muna natin kung ano ang laman. So, first is the coil machine. So, coil machine, guys. I think this is 10 wraps, guys. So, some copy ng Mickey Sharp. So, it's not original, guys. 10, 10 wraps. Then we have uh, power supply, so it has mini power supply, guys. Uh, important. Then we have the hip cord. Then we have the foot switch. So Dahil mura siya guys, so we cannot uh, guarantee na durable siya. So, this kind of foot switch uh, in the long run, uh, para mag-loss contact siya in the long run. So we have 10 pieces of R3 disposable tips so it's not bad for 1500 guys uh, we have this aluminum wick we have a pair of gloves uh, ink cups we have some rubber bands uh, gourmet and we have this Allen wrench and O-rings. So yung Allen wrench guys, uh, you will use it to adjust this uh, this part here. So, kasi pa gumagamit ka ng coil, nagbabibrate siya every now and then. So, na lulus yung mga thread niya. So, kailangan mo siya higpitan every now and then. So, so by the way guys, this video is just for newbie. So, if you're a pro artist, uh, this video is not for you. So, we have this stencil solution guys. So, we have stencil solution. Then, sa uh, vitamin A and D after care. And we have this black ink so this free black ink guys uh, uh, I, I can advise I, I do not advise to use this thing uh, this not safe for human skin so practice ink lang siya guys so huwag niyong gagamitin kung itato sa tao guys baka may mga adverse effects sa skin so para lang siya dito sa free na practice skin. So, meron siyang free practice skin. So, itong yung gagamitin mo. Pero, sa balak, huwag mong gagamitin mo. And, we have 10 needles, guys. 10 disposable needles. And, lastly, we have 
our stencil uh, paper, thermal, thermal paper. So this is where we trace our design. We have this. I think it's one wall, but it's written in Chinese, so you can't understand it. Ah, there's an English translation. So, yun lang guys, ang laman sa 1,500 na kit for beginners. So, try natin guys kung gumagana ba yung machine. So, yung grip guys. So, ano So, you will use this Allen wrench to adjust this thing here. So, Tighten this up. The back stem of the grip. Para mag-hold siya dito sa ating machine. Ayan guys. So, meron na tayong ayan. Tapos nyan. Kuha ka na grumay. So guys, let's ya. Lalagay mo siya dito sa matcher bar. Ayan. Tapos, kumuha ka ng ito, uh, disposable tip guys. So, so, gamit ko rin ang Allen wrench para ikitan nyo. So, yung mga disposable tip guys, pagkatapos nyo gamitin ay tapon nyo na ang type. Uh, huwag nyo i-recycle or gagamitin nyo. So, ang isang gamit lang siya. Yung ginamit natin is 3 na tip. So, yung needles, uh, needle na gagamitin natin is 3 din. So, So if you open the needles, uh, I advise you should wear gloves para sterile at uh, can avoid cross contamination. I think sobrang laki ng gloves nila. Kuha na lang tayo ng ibang gloves. Tapos, sakan nyo i-open yung needles, guys. Check daw may loss kung nakikita ka sa video. Masakto ba ang nyo? So, yung brumi, guys. Uh, para hindi para fit yung needle natin so 
adjust natin yung back stem guys para So by the way guys, uh, this is a coil machine. So maraming type ng machines. So sa mga hindi nakakaalam na uh, gusto kong mag-start mag So may rotary, ito coil. At uh, ang latest today is yung pen type. At meron na ding mga wireless pen type. So lalagyan natin siya ng rubber band para hindi mag-vibrate yung needles natin uh, para okay yung ating pagkatapu Assemble na natin yung grip sa machine at saka nalagyan na natin ng needles at uh, rubber band. So, ikakabit na lang natin siya sa ating power supply para meron siyang kuryente at ma-re-regulate natin yung kuryente na dadaloy sa ating machine. So, ito yung ating power supply. Tapos, ikakabit natin sa power supply ang ating foot switch. So, ang foot switch guys, ito yung on and off na switch para sa ating machine. Ikakabit natin po guys. So again, this video is for newbies or those na walang alam sa tatlo. Na gustong malaman yung mga basic setup so, if knowledgeable ka na uh, this video is not for you so ikakabit natin yung code switch tapos ang ating clipboard Clipboard, uh, ikakabit natin sa ating machine. So, dito. Try natin. So, ayan. On siya. So, okay yung anda niya, guys. So, tapos, Meron tayo dito ang ink cups. Dito mo ilalagay yung inks. Ito ba maglalagay ng ink sa ink cups. So, dapat malinis yung table mo pag nagtatato ka. So, dito makalat kasi nag-unbox tayo. Pero pag actual session na dapat malinis. Uh, you cover the your tattoo. Uh, workstation with clean wraps clean it first, then clean wraps tapos yun mo ilalagay yung ink wraps mo sa ink then yun mo dun ka kukuha ng ink you will just dip your the tip of the needles to your ink wraps with the ink then you can 
procedures. You know. So, paano ka magtatatu? Uh, first, stencil mo muna yung design. So, gamit ka ng stencil stuff. So, ito yung ating stencil paper. So, for example, uh, yung design natin is star. So, for example, star yung design natin. So, you will trace that uh, star doon sa tracing paper. Trace mo na. So, makikita mo sa likod ng papel na malikit na yung, dis, yung stencil paper or uh, yeah, stencil paper. Tapos, uh, you will use your uh, stencil stuff or stencil binder. Anything na pang transfer ng design sa part ng body mo itatatok so spray it there tapos idikit mo yung design at ayan ah. nakadikit na po yung design dyan ayan. so meron na tayong guide sa ating uh, design sa ating pagtatato. Uh, may guide na tayo. Madali na lang para sundin yung guide. May kinanging. Tapos, meron. It's okay na, uh, I mean, the best na mag-start kayo sa practice team na para may idea kayo kung paano i-unikit yung tayo sa bala. Pag nakuha mo na or nagamay mo na, saka na kayo mag-practice sa tunay na bala. So, I think that's all for today guys. Uh, let me know in the comment section if you have some questions or anything. Thanks for watching us.